What's up, y'all? It's your boy, Young Splash, with another video. And today, I'm doing a, I'm doing a game. I'm, not, I'm doing gameplay of Life is Life is Strange, right? So, I, this game just became free. I've seen this game before. I've seen people play it before, but you know, I just decided to do it. Like I looked at the the game and think I was thinking like I wouldn't want to spend my money on this game. It doesn't look worth it. But let's try it out. Life is Strange is a story-based game featured players' choices constant on all fashion decisions. I didn't get to read that. Come on now. Whoa! I'm gonna be quiet on the cutscenes, by the way, so you guys can hear. I want to do something different from 2k and other games that I play with GTA and stuff like that so hope you guys are fine with this different kind of play you know what I mean jeez I knew this game was beautiful but I didn't know it was this beautiful I'll be honest with you Dude, just look at that like I need a screenshot of that just look at that that's crazy Everybody said <laughs> get screenshots on your phone. I got you. They just pa this pause it right now. I was about to say let's go ahead and pause it and look at that beautifulness. Holy shit! Oh, I forgot about that. If you're an under the age of 13, I suggest you don't watch this. But if you're cool like that, I guess you can. Well, if your parents allow you, but there will be curse words in this video. So. Sorry. Whoa. Whoa! That was so surreal. Called film little pieces of time. Oh, didn't mean to press that. But he could be talking about photography, as he likely was. Okay, I'm in class. Everything's cool. I am okay. From light to shadow, from color to chiaroscuro. What now. The can you give me an example of a photographer who perfectly captured the human condition in black and white? I didn't fall asleep, and that Anybody? sure didn't feel like a dream. Bueller? Weird. Diane Arbus. Look at this crap. How can I show this to Mr. Jefferson? I can hear the class laughing at me now. That's not bad. We talk about this before. There you go, Victoria. Why Arbus? Because of her images of hopeless faces. I can't believe I still have I this like pencil case. I should upgrade to the 21st dangerous. century. She but saw I like it old school. Right? And frankly, it's bullshit. I haven't kept up with my journal as much as I should. If anybody else looked at this, what would they think? Oh, I get it. This is like how you sweat through episodes and everybody. There's a Victoria Chase. I don't need to read all this. I can just tell by the sunglasses that she's... Eh. And she was animals. Not trying to like assume what she does, but I feel like she's just one of those girls that cares about more of style and fashion. If anybody else looked at this, Seriously, what would though, they think? I could frame any one of you in a dark corner and capture you in a moment of desperation. And any one of you could do that oh, to the me. Camera. Isn't that too easy? Too obvious? What if Arbus chose? Shh, shh, I believe Max has taken what you kids call a selfie. 
A dumb word for a wonderful photographic tradition. And Max has a gift. Of course, as you all know, the photo portrait has been popular since the early 1800s. Your generation was not the first to use images for selfie expression. Sorry, I couldn't resist. The point remains that the portraiture has oh, always <laughs> been a vital aspect of art and photography for as long as it's been around. Now, Max, since you've captured our interest and clearly want to join the conversation, can you please tell us the name of the process that gave birth to the first self-portraits? Uh, you asking, asking me? L let me think. Um... You either know this or not, Max. Is there anybody here who knows their stuff? Louis Daguerre was a French painter who created daguerreotypes, a process that gave portraits a sharp reflective style like a mirror. Now you're totally stuck in the retro zone. Sad face. Dodgy. Very good, Victoria. The Daguerrean process brought out fine detail in people's faces, making them extremely popular Sorry, for Sorry, Max. No more selfies the right now. American daguerreotype self oh, no more selfies. By Robert Cornelius. You can find out all about him in your textbook. Or even online. And guys, don't forget the deadline to submit a photo in the Everyday Heroes contest. I'll fly out with the winner to San Francisco, where you'll be feted by the art world. It's great exposure, and it can kickstart a career in photography. So Stella and Alyssa, get it together. Taylor, don't hide. I'm still waiting for your entry, too. And yes, Max, I see you pretending not to see me. Dang. Victoria doesn't waste a second kissing ass. Even if a photo for the competition, everybody in class is turning in a photo, so you see the dilemma? I know, Mr. Jefferson. I just worked so hard in the shot, and I'm sure you know what it's like to be consumed by your work. I just really think Everyday Heroes is an important cultural event, and I want to represent Blackwell Academy. You have just by participating. Mm. I don't know what they're talking about, but anyways, guys, I know this is short, but I just want to end this just to see how you guys think about this before I start the gameplay. So, uh, thank you guys for watching. I'll see you guys later. Bye.